now whenever you come across such uh, such expression which is quadratic and it talks about some integral number so in this case prime number is also an integer right so the very first thing irrespective what the question says the very first thing what you have to do is to factorize it write that quadratic equation in terms of factor ye pehla kaam hota hai chahe koi bhi question mein kuch bhi pucha ho agar integral related puche to factorize karna hi karna hai theek hai so here you can just see just by inspection you can see that this 24 is what 12 into 2 right एंड ट्वेल्व प्लस टू करूंगा तो क्या आ जाएगा फोर्टीन आ जाएगा ठीक है इतना आना चाहिए वी शुड नॉट अप्लाई दैट क्वाडेड इक्वेशन का रूट वाला फॉर्मुला ठीक है वो बहुत लंबा हो जाएगा सो वी कैन से दैट एन स्क्वायर माइनस फोर्टीन एन प्लस ट्वेंटी फोर इफ आई वॉन्ट टू फैक्टराइज दैन द रूट्स आर वॉट ट्वेल्व एंड टू सो ये इट वुड बी एन माइनस ट्वेल्व एंड एन माइनस टू राइट गाइज ठीक है एंड दिस इट सेज इट हैज टू बी अ प्राइम नंबर सो लेट मी एज्यूम दैट द प्राइम नंबर इज पी now from here we'll understand the another property of prime number and that if i take any prime number say 37 37 is a prime number i want to write it as a product of two number there is no way but to write this way right agar mujhe deliberately do number do positive number use karne hai to make the product as prime number then the only way is take one and the number itself right there is no other way clear but if i asked about the integer then i have various other ways of writing it and that is i can write it as this is one of the way and the other way is i can take minus 37 in fact one more way will be minus 37 into minus 1 right so there are two ways wherein i can write any prime number as a product of two integers one in which both are positive and one in which both are negative clear guys yahan tak clear hai so that's the concept i'll be using so here if it is a prime number and it is a product of two numbers na the moment i take any value of n then this will become one number the other will become the second number and this is only possible if one among them is one and the other is a prime number right so hum kya karte hain hum assume karte hain ki if this is one then this has to be the prime number and this if this is minus one then this has to be a prime number which is uh, negative of prime number and if this is p then this has to be one or if this is minus p then this has to be minus 1 then you will see that in each of these cases the product will be p and p is a positive here i am taking positive in fact prime number itself are positive so no need to say that positive prime number right so you have to check for these four cases so let us check the first case ye wala case check karte hain so in this case we can say that n minus 12 has to be equal to how much 1 therein will be getting the value of n is equal to 13 clear 13 is a prime number but the question is not asking about n right here n can be any positive integer so yahan pe n ke liye necessity nahi hai prime right ye expression prime hona chahiye so n is equal to 13 so the value of n minus 2 the other term will become what for n is equal to 13 it will be 13 minus 2 which is what 11 so here the value of p would be what 11 clear guys so can i say this would be the answer or a part of the answer yahan tak clear hai jo main kar raha hu If I check for the next, then what will happen? N minus twelve. चलो मैं next वाला कर रहा हूँ उसी जैसा ही है, ठीक है? What I am doing is that either this has to be minus one, and for that corresponding value of n, this has to be negative of some prime number. Then only the product will be a prime number, right? So I am just checking that. So if I take n minus twelve to be minus one, ठीक है? so here i'll be getting the value of n to be how much 11 right guys so if n is 11 then what will happen that 11 minus 12 is minus 1 ye to humne yahi se nikal diya tha but what will happen to n minus 2 now n is 11 then 11 minus 2 will become what 9 right so p ki value minus 9 ho jayegi anyway 9 bhi hota to it's not a prime number so that means this case we have to ignore correct now if move to the next अब नेक्स्ट के लिए वी डोंट हैव टू लुक फॉर पी अब इसको चेक करके देखते हैं सो एन माइनस टू इफ इट इज इक्वल टू वन देन द वैल्यू ऑफ एन इज हाउ मच थ्री नाउ लेट अस सब्सटीट्यूट द वैल्यू ऑफ एन इज इक्वल टू थ्री टू दिस प्लेस इन दिस केस आई एल बी गेटिंग इट एज वॉट थ्री माइनस ट्वेल्व विच इज माइनस नाइन सो द वैल्यू ऑफ पी विल बी वॉट माइनस नाइन अगेन दिस केस वी हैव टू एलिमिनेट ठीक है प्राइम नहीं आ रहा है लास्ट केस अगेन एन माइनस टू I have to equate with with minus one, so the value of n will be how much one. Now the moment I put the value of n is equal to minus one here, then this will be what minus eleven, and this portion will be what uh, minus of one. Clearly, you can see that this equals what eleven, which is a prime number. 
that means the last case is a valid case for us so what would be the answer it says for how many value of n so what would be the answer the answer is 2 और ऐसे सवाल इसी तरीके से ही बनते हैं प्राइम नंबर है मेजरली ये दो टाइप के सवाल होते हैं ठीक है वेर इन यू हैव टू पुट दी वैल्यूज ऑफ प्राइम नंबर डायरेक्टली एंड चेक एंड फॉर रेस्ट ऑफ दी हायर प्राइम नंबर यू हैव टू यूज दी फंड ऑफ सिक्स के प्लस वन और सिक्स के माइनस वन अदरवाइज यू विल बी आस्ट अबाउट फॉर वट पर्टिकुलर वैल्यूज दी गिवन एक्सप्रेशन इज प्राइम देर इन यू हैव टू फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल फैक्ट्राइज दी एक्सप्रेशन एंड पुट वन ऑफ द एक्सप्रेशन एज वन एंड दी अदर टू बी अ प्राइम नंबर एंड देर इन यू गो ऑन चेकिंग फॉर ऑल दी पॉसिबल वैल्यूज This is a standard process of solving any question pertaining to prime number. Majority of the questions prime number कुछ के कुछ ऐसे ही होते हैं